Just talking about your success and, and as I say, the bigness of it all, you think of songs like Chasing Cars, Just Say Yes, Run, big songs that have become anthems, but also mean an awful lot personally to a lot of people. I'm sure people write to you or they tell you when they meet you, that song was Got Me Through This or that song was uh, significant here. Are you aware of that? Do you, does that, does that uh, hearten you, appeal to you? Do you care about that sort of thing? Oh, yeah, no, certainly, certainly care. It's lovely to hear. Um, I mean, for, for example, Run was the very first sort of hit that we ever had after 10 years of nothing. Yeah. Uh, um, and uh, that, that song was written uh, in a, a, a flat in Glasgow. I was living in Glasgow at the time. There was no electricity, and the electricity had just gone out in the flat. Yeah. We had the, the shower head was held on by uh, sticky tape. Right. Uh, there was one burner on the oven that worked. This is like you a know, Dickens novel. We, we got yeah, yeah. Well, well, you know, we yeah. uh, wasn't wasn't maybe quite as bad okay. as I'm painting it, but it was it was. Yeah. Um, we were still living sort of in our mid twenties, a kind of a, a, the life that we were living, maybe in our late teens. Yes. Um, and uh, I wrote that song to to, to uh, as a kind of a. To, to, as, a, as a will to protect my friends and my family from, sure. from, 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 from the darkness, and it became the song that kind of changed everything for us, you know. But it was written alone in an apartment with yeah. the lights off, literally the lights off, and I sung, the, I wrote the words "light up, light up." Yeah, I mean, I seems mean, it's pretty it, obvious to me now. It, yeah. it, was a play, it was a cry for more than just electricity. I but. was gonna say. <laughs>